learning for like two weeks. I did not realize how hard college would be. I have been like jam packed with work and I've just had no time at all but I'm now broken up for two weeks so hopefully I'll get four videos a week up in these two weeks. This is a fall slash autumn, I don't know what you want to call it, inspired room decor video. This is actually a huge collab with three of my really good YouTube friends and before I like say anything, I am so sorry Charlotte, Inora and Haley, that my video is a week late. My Wi-Fi was down, I didn't have time to film, edit. I'm honestly so, so sorry and I really hope you guys can forgive me. But anyway, this video is a collab with Inora from Inora K, Charlotte from Miss Charlotte Beauty One and Haley from Berry Pink Lips. All of the channels are amazing and here's a sneak peek of all their videos. Hi, my name is Inora and on my channel you'll see how to make your own Starbucks drinks, an outfit idea for the fall time and some activities. My my name is Charlotte and on my channel I'll be showing you guys some of my favorite full fashion essentials. I'm Taylor here and today I'm going to be filming a DIY fall breakfast video. So if you guys are interested in their videos they will all be linked in the description box down below and I seriously recommend that you guys check them out. But anyway yeah this video is just really like they are honestly all of the ones are very cheap and very easy. I have made all of it with things I found in my house bar maybe one or two things. I think the most expensive one was like like seven pounds. If you are new to my channel then hello I am Lewis please click that subscribe button down below because it takes a few seconds and it makes me really happy. Also give this video a thumbs up if you want some more DIYs. I was thinking about maybe some DIY jewelry or some DIY clothes maybe some DIY Halloween videos so if you guys want that be sure to give this video a thumbs up so I know you guys are enjoying DIYs and let's get on to the DIYs which is why you're all here and it was a very long intro. On with the DIYs. What do you mean? Oh, when you nod your head yes, but you want to say no, what do you mean? For the studded jewellery pot, you will need a bowl, obviously, a hot glue gun and some studs of your choice. So my studs had the sticky up thing at the back, but it was really easy. You just had to push each sticky out thing down to make it flat. And then I just hot glued the back of the stud and then glued it down onto my bowl. And the bowl is rounded, so it was kind of hard to stick. But um, after a while, I just got used to it. And then just, you want to repeat all of it. It does take a while, so <laughs> put on your favorite YouTuber or TV show or something while you do this. And you want to just fill up the whole top row. And then once I'd done that, I flipped my bowl over and did the bottom row as well, just so the whole bowl was filled with studs. Depending on how big your bowl is, it's going to be different for everyone, obviously. But I honestly love this so much. And I don't really have a jewelry holder, so this is just so perfect. So to make these adorable candles, you will obviously need a candle, some scissors, and an old sweater you don't mind not wearing again. And it's very, very simple. All you need to do is put the sleeve of the sweater up the candle and find where it fits, and then cut, mark it, and cut off the point where the bottom of the candle is and that's literally it once you've done that you can put the sweater sleeve back on the candle and you have your own little sweater sleeve for a candle you can hot glue gun this down as it makes it more stable but because i go through candles so quickly i can then just transfer furthest to other candles otherwise i would be ruining quite a lot of sweaters For the final DIY, you will need some fairy lights, some clothes pegs, leaves, either fake or real, and some pictures of your own. So I just got these pictures, this one's from Beautycon, and I got a few with my friend Radical Georgia, and this is really simple. Basically, between each fairy light, I put a clothes peg, and then alternatively put leaves and pictures, and that's it. Honestly, I am in love with this. It spices up your room so much, and it is so simple and so quick. So that's it for today's video, I really hope you guys enjoy it, and as always remember to subscribe and check out everyone's videos down below. Bye!